Justice Alito? Can you imagine a legislator thinking we should ban machine guns, but we should not ban bump stocks? Is there any reason why a legislator might reach that judgment? I think there is. Bump stocks can help people who have disabilities, who have problems with finger dexterity, people who have arthritis in their fingers. There could be a valid reason for preserving the legality of these devices as a matter of policy, even while similar weapons, such as the fully automatic machine guns, are being banned. Whether Congress would ultimately make that judgment, we would have to wait and find out whether they would decide it along those ways. But there are respectable arguments for why these could remain legal as a matter of policy. Why would anybody? I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. Yeah, in the field of statutory interpretation, Justice Scalia's bet noir was the Church of the Holy Trinity, a case where he thought that uh, the literal language of the statute uh, had to control, even though it's pretty hard to think that Congress actually meant that to apply in certain situations. As you see this case, is this another Church of the Holy Trinity case? I would say it's quite as egregious as Church of the Holy Trinity, but the arguments the government's making are certainly in the spirit of Holy Trinity, the borrow a phrase that was used from the Holy Trinity opinion. And I don't think a textualist judge can accept the rationale that's being offered by the U.S. government. And they are, in their brief, especially making purposivist arguments along the lines of what we saw in Church of the Holy Trinity. Thank you.